Thank you for staying with us. June 26 is recognized as the United Day Against Drug Abuse and Illicit Trafficking as a way of strengthening action and cooperation to achieve the goal of an international society free of drug abuse. Today at the Brian Lara Promenade, different organizations came together with the Ministry of National Security to share some much-needed information with members of the public. Mahalia Joseph has more. Various stakeholders came together on Friday to inform citizens on preventative drug use methods. Manager of the National Drug Council of the Ministry of National Security, Esther Best, says the organizations that came out have the ability to teach patients how to counteract drug use. So we have agencies like NADAP that are here, agencies like the Red Cross that deal with HIV infection because you know HIV infection is linked to drug use and the Parent, National Parent Teachers Association, skills training, all of the agencies that we think would act as a deterrent. Prisons is here as well, plus organized crime, narcotics and firearms bureau. So it really is a mixture of agencies, both government and non-government agencies. Ms. Best even used the story about the four boys who were arrested recently for having marijuana in their possession while at school. She says the incident is a major cause for concern and the council hopes to prevent such things from happening in the future. Because these are young men who were using drugs in a school bathroom and we would really like to see a different approach taken to this issue. While we understand that it is illegal, they are children and so we want to see student support services, we want to see community police not the arrest and charge in the way that was done. The National Parent Teachers Association took the opportunity to encourage parents to play a more active role in the household. President of the NPTA, Zina Ramatali, says drug prevention starts in the home and in the school. We need to encourage our young people about the dangers of using drugs and trafficking drugs. So today I'm hoping that uh, almost a thousand people we are hoping can pass through here as parents, teachers, guardians and uh, you know get information on the dangers of drugs and so on. She says children are faced with many elements in their school environment and it's time to take a stand. And if you look at our jerseys, it is take a stand against bullying and we are saying take a stand against any illicit thing, right? Be it drugs, be it abuse, domestic violence, right? Bullying in school, in the workplace, right? That is why we are here today, to send a message out to the nation. June 26th is recognized as the United Day Against Drug Abuse and Illicit Trafficking. Mahalia Joseph, C News.